Hello and welcome to today's video. Today I'm going to be adding my Aladdin Series 25 paraffin heater as there has been a forecast for frost. It might look a bit old as it is from the 1960s although it does still work fine. It has a fuel tank which can hold a gallon of paraffin or kerosene as it's widely known and it has a fuel gauge which is still working on the side. So what we're going to do is start by pulling this hatch around this side here which unlocks it and then just carefully tipping it down. So what we're going to do is we're going to raise the wick just over halfway. Now I'm going to light the wick so I'll get the lighter and just on the back like that and just get this lighted. Right, so now I'm going to grab this and carefully push it back over. Then just like that and trim it. I've got a blue frame around. Uh -uh. Right, we've managed to get it lit now and we've got a nice blue flame on it. If the reason why we don't want an orange flame in the paraffin heater is because it'll produce too much carbon monoxide which is very deadly and if you get and if you have too much you can just be knocked out. So you've, we've got to trim it with this wheel which is basically just raises the wick or lowers it so you get the right amount of air in which for just the flame. So it's what we're going to do is we're going to um, blow it out and then get it down on the ground where we're going to have it tonight when there's a frost. We've just let it cool down after blowing it out and now we've moved it down to the ground because you can't move them while they're still hot. Now we've got it set in a position we're going to have it for when the frost hits tonight. It's already lit now down there so in about 10 minutes time once it's heated up we're going to do some final readjustments to the flame just before we leave it on all night. So that's it for today's video, I hope you enjoyed, thanks for watching, make sure to like, subscribe and share this video with your friends, bye.